Hi, hello, hello, hello. How are you? Heading back home after a night out. Wow, I don't even remember the last time that I had a night out. I'm walking back home and uh, I'm thinking about life. <laughs> That's something that I've been doing uh, every day in those 43 years. Life. Moments seems like we are in control. Oh, maybe like the right term would be moments seems like we can create, appropriate, and moments that seems like uh, we can do nothing. It's like uh, we have a good and uh, we have bad yin and yang. So there are good moments and bad moments. And uh, sometimes, you know, there are one uh, within another, within each other. This is a short journey, isn't it? This is such a short journey. And it feels, you know, when we are young and we don't know, we are, we are learning and we think. You know, we are sure because this is normal for everyone. We feel, we are sure about what is life because we haven't gained yet all uh, the information we need to understand the bit we don't understand. And when we get that, you know, we realize that, not for all of us, but for many, that life is such a short journey. Someone might decide to do evil. It's like, a, well, if it's a short journey, I don't give a shit. You know, they might have a, their own reason to do that. You know, they might believe that after there is nothing, or they might feel like a, as a, like a punishment to be here. And sometimes it feels like a punishment. But sometimes it feels like a good. Sure thing, this is short, extremely short. And uh, I know in my journey that there is more, much more. There is much more than this uh, physical body. There is much more because I saw it. I heard it, I feel it. I experience it. It's not just about people that told me that there are stories, the countless people that I met, but I saw it. There is something huge. There is something huge. And that's really all of this that seems such a, so real. That seems so real, you know. We, you know, knock the door. If it's so heavy and hard, and this actually is an illusion. Created it from wood? I have, a, I have no idea. Yeah, of course, I met uh, so many people that told me that they've been in the other side, or they knew someone that been in the other side, or I read stories that there is. They call it the Maker, God, the Universe. There is something. And this is an illusion. This is such an illusion. I had a dream the other night. I'm not going to go in detail about the dream. But the feeling I could... 
I could feel it. I can I could feel it like if it was now like right now if someone would touch me I could feel it I could feel the touch I could feel it I could describe right now all the feeling so we call it dream so that's how we've been taught to call that the dreams what if it's their portals to something else? What if it's just our body living and regenerating while we we'll, we sleep? You know, sleeping is just a, a connecting to char the charger. This is no real. It feels real, and we've been programmed to feel it real. But it's no. It's no. This is just an illusion, a short illusion that it will end quicker and sooner than we think. We can learn, obviously, suffering makes you learn quicker. It's not the case that I'm sharing those feelings right now because I was feeling pain within. There was so much pain within myself, and uh, yes, this is now my way not just to share my experience, other people's experiences, so to help others, but even uh, has me. But at the same time, uh, this probably helping someone else, someone else, because you know, sharing those faults that liberates me. Obviously, at the same time, someone might listen, eh? and uh, and feel the same, and then maybe might help them to find a to find a solution. Oh well, this is, this is a game, as much that we've been programmed to believe that it's real. This is a game, and uh, we are all actors, acting a role, we all do. This is a big stage. Good night, everyone.